today. From... A pretty big early test for the defense coming up. What can they dial up here to try and thwart this third down situation? Trying to pick it up on the ground with Harris. And he's going to have the first down at about the 38. A red zone alert. Let's jump back in here. First and 10 at the 16. Now a first down carry for Harris. Broken tackle. And all the way down inside the five to the four. We're relentless a lot with guys who are aggressive on the field. In this case, it really fits, doesn't it? How about his ability to break tackles and his feet never stop moving? Harris. And he's in. Touchdown, Patriots. Damian Harris taking it in from four yards out as his guys have now moved out in front. And he was excellent on that drive. He deserved to be the one to get across the chart. Oh, I agree with you. Defense looking for a third down stop in the second quarter. From the midfield stripe, they'll look to throw. And that will be incomplete. First half of action nearly complete. Time maybe for one final drive before the break as we get back down to the field. They go play action here on first down. Hunter Henry brings it in. And they've got it well across midfield, down to the 40 before it's all said and done. Now a play fake here on first down. He's going deep for Brown. And it'll be incomplete. Good job staying with him defensively. And it'll bring up second down. Second and 10, a very chilly day here, but no snow. And yeah, I got to say, if it's going to be this cold, I want snow. <laughs> you should see Charles' face. He's looking at me like I'm crazy. Now the Patriots going to use one of their timeouts as the clock will stop with 34 seconds to go before halftime. play fake. He'll look to throw. And that's going to be caught for a Patriot touchdown. Van Jefferson there to make the grab. And the Patriots have taken the lead. That could be an important swing right there. A touchdown of the final minute of the half to take the lead. Fourth down coming up. Decision time now as this would be a long field goal attempt. Now the Patriots going to use one of their timeouts. It's just their first. They'll be down to two remaining as we step aside here in the fourth quarter. A fourth down coming up. Decision time now as this would be a long field goal attempt. And a great job here. This is going to turn out to be a beauty. This is marked down at about the three-yard line. That punt was near perfection. It's a third down situation in the fourth quarter. Time to see if this defense is up to the task. They'll look to throw again. They'll roll him out right. And, oh, he took that in one So this offense, they've made their way into the red zone now. They've got it a couple yards inside the 20 at the 18. The play action fake. They'll look to throw. Toward the back corner of the end zone, but he could not get the feet down. This will wind up incomplete. Hollywood Brown, the intended receiver, but it'll be second down. Back to throw again. Finding Bourne here over the middle. Touchdown, Patriots! 
Kendrick Bourne. His second touchdown of the afternoon. And the Patriots. for a nice return on this upcoming punt here as they trail in the fourth quarter. On is the punt team now as this one set away. And this will be taken at the 13. Now it appears we're going to get whistles and a stop. A man down. to throw it's incomplete took a shot couldn't connect that would have been a tough catch but in this two minute drill those are the ones you really hope your guys come up with yeah you don't want your guy to be able to take the out because it was a tough catch you needed him to come up with that one because if he does it alters the perspective of this two minute drill doesn't it and he'll be out of bounds but able to get it up past the 45 now, after the completion, we're going to get a timeout, an injured player. We'll get a report when we return to Foxborough. He'll look to throw. Being chased out left. He's going to let it fly. And this one is incomplete. Ooh, that's certainly not the worst thing. It stops the clock and lets your offense catch its breath and lets us exhale a little bit. Now I expect them to call a couple of plays in the huddle, so they're ready if a tackle happens inbounds. Buying time to his left. And he'll be out of bounds just shy of the 40. Late in the game, defense trying to avoid a big play. He's able to work out of the passing game, turn it into a run, pick up the first, and stop the clock as well. And you know in this situation, everything is sped up. The intensity, the thinking, everyone's movements. But for a quarterback, he has to continue to be what we call a flatliner. Level in everything he does and read the clock, feel it in the pocket, and go at the appropriate time. Tell you what, he's been able to put the ball in some tight spots all game long. That throw, no different. Yeah, a lot of people would call it a gutsy type of a throw. I think he looks at it as, I can do it. So it's not that big of a deal to me. I'm going to keep firing. And seeing no options, he just tosses this one away incomplete. Now that'll bring up second down. Back to throw. Going for it all. Toward the back corner of the end zone, but he could not get the feet down. This will wind up incomplete. Back-to-back -back incompletions, but we know this is definitely four-down territory. Time not on their side. I don't think they want to try and get the first down in two installments. I think they got to go and get it right here, right now. And they're going to mark him down short, maybe by about a yard, if that. Now, after the completion, we're going to get a timeout, an injured player. Game on the line, season on the line. They're going for it here on fourth down. We'll get a report when we return to Foxborough. The fourth down run successful. Now they look to pay it off on first down. They'll look to throw. Looking for his running back, and he's got it. And he'll be brought down this time at the five-yard line. It's another 10 yards on that one and another first down. And with that last play, he's now up over that 300-yard mark. And in today's NFL, it almost feels routine. And I hate that when you talk about a 300-yard passing game. To me, 300 yards still signify. And he can't get him thrown away. He's taken down. And down by five, they've got to go for it here on fourth down. One final shot. They'll look to throw. Oh, and a bad throw there. It's intercepted. Picked off down near the five. And the Browns are going to hang on on the final play. They get the turnover to seal this football game.
And looking at it from the perspective of the losing side here in this divisional round, it, it all ends so abruptly, doesn't it? A few hours ago, you've got all this hope and anticipation of maybe a deep run, and now you're out of it. Well, let's applaud the team that won, and rightly so. They, they're moving on. They still have a chance to get to the big game. But let's not bury the team.